So, what is going on with Gemini? Mercury in retrograde. March. Uh, celebration, maybe. 2018. Mercury in retrograde. Gemini. March 2018, April. Mercury in retrograde. Gemini. March to April 2018. Energy is coming towards Gemini. Mercury in retrograde. March and April 2018. As you know, I shuffle these before. I tell everybody that. I meditate on Gemini. I like to get them nice and mixed up, shuffled up, blended. But this is your own personal plan. Let's see what's going on. Yeah, the Empress reverses the overall energy, so things may not be taken off, you know, the way you want to. For to for to you know, growth, uh, partition, um, I'll say, you know, just basically blessings in general. You don't feel like you're getting at this time, but we shall see. That's just maybe the overall energy of what is occurring, and it's outside energy. Maybe just you know something that just went off kilter a little bit. Forgive me for my speech, I'm partially deaf, and sometimes I think I talk too loud. Sometimes I'm not loud enough, and sometimes my words aren't clear. I got a new camera. It's a little bit confusing. And I got five cards out. This is Mercury and Retrograde, and the energies that are coming towards you. You don't have to accept these energies, but you got something coming towards you. It's a ten of swords. Someone may feel like... Um, you stabbed them in the back. They may come towards you accusingly saying, you stabbed me in the back. You you cheated me. You wronged me. You, you said something in confidence that I held confidence in you about. So let's find out. Uh, why is the Ten of Swords in the past? It's like a past coming up into Mercury and retrograde. So this may have already occurred and they're going to come at you during Mercury and retrograde. So why is the Ten of Swords there? Why is the Ten of Swords there? Uh, someone may feel like maybe they thought they had options with you or a choice with you, or maybe they thought you were going to offer them something of, you know, of a multiple type situation, maybe uh, merchandise it could be, or just go, it could be a personal relationship, but someone may feel stabbed in the back. And options have ceased, and you may stop this, or they may stop this. So if you uh, have this coming up, this can be changed because it's not major arcana. So someone may feel like there was a miscommunication, because that's what Mercury in retrograde does. It's all about miscommunication a lot of times, and they may feel that you know they heard something wrong and, and they make a decision against you. So make sure your communications are very clear during this time. Ugh. It's all about communications. So the warning is there and you can control this. Now you're coming out of hermit mode. You know, you're wanting to come out of hermit mode. Let's find out. Or it could be someone's, you're wanting someone else to come out of hermit mode of not actually socializing and getting around or keeping to themselves because the obstacle is the hermit reverse so it's either either it's either one of those things so let's find out for sure though hermit card why are you there for gemini why are you there for gemini queen of swords it could involve uh an air sign and um it could be you could be your energy but I'm thinking as energy coming in so it could be an Aquarius or a Libra or someone who's just got a lot of air in their chart or has that kind of energy when a Queen of Wands a Queen of Swords excuse me is reversed she is not somebody that is um, easy to talk to she will you know you she may bite your head off pretty easily and and her words are very you know cutting now, it could be that this person was at one time quiet and they're coming towards you and they're no longer quiet. And they may say some pretty, you know, aggressive wording towards you. And it could very well have to feel stabbed in the back. Now, 
at the current environment during this time, you got the Three of Swords reversed. So it very well could be, Gemini, someone from the past, that there was a third party situation may come back and try to communicate with you. And not maybe, I got to find out if it's this person, it may not be something you want to deal with at the time. Or you may want to, you know, make sure the, the communications are, are, you know, where they're not miscommunicating with you. Um, three of Swords, reverse. Why are you there? Three of Swords, reverse. Why are you there? Three of Swords, why are you there? Reversed. Yeah, this is someone um, stagnant over a third party, possibly past situation. And why? The reason why I call it past because it is reverse, something that already happened. So you may be hesitant to even deal with someone that may be coming back that involved in the past a third party situation. You may be waiting around and seeing what's going to happen. Now, the overall energy and the current, it's its the overall energy of what started this. It's the outside environment. It is uh, what also is, they're all what's coming towards you. But this is like a main energy of, of the outside of why this is occurring. And it's Queen of Cups. And she's in the upright. And it could be a water sign. It could be Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Or it could be just someone with a dreamy attitude and poetic and pleasant to be around. Kind of motherly and nurturing. But she's in the upright. Let's find out whoops, what's going on here. Yeah, you may get a message from this person. This may be two different situations. That this person, the watery type person, may come and give you a message. And this person... Um, it's a stable message. It may be an offer of a message, but the page is like a messenger. It's also like a younger person, but they may be coming in and they may offer you a message. They may be wanting to give you a message, but in the end here, you got the four of swords, Dorm Mercury and retrograde. Let's find out what that's about. Four of swords. Why are you there? Gemini, four of swords. Why are you there for Gemini? It's in the upright. There's that uh, Ten of Swords, but it's it's in reverse. So you had the Ten of Swords over here. You got the Ten of Swords over here, but it's in reverse. And with the Four of Swords, that's someone taking a break, laying down, not wanting to mess with anything. And it could be because of a backstabbing situation, someone feeling backstabbed. So you're more or less not probably going to even um, want to discuss whatever is coming in. I think you got two different situations coming in. But one with with a water sign, another one with a possible air sign, or those qualities, and one may have been a past uh, relationship that was a backstabbing situation that was felt, and they may communicate with you, and you may be done with it. You're saying that's in the past. I took a break from that. So what it is is you just like not wanting to invite this situation to where it, there's another argument whether there's a hard feelings, even though someone may try to bring in or vice versa, like these energies can be reversed, but I'm saying it's coming towards you. You may not even entertain it. You may say, um, we did this before. It's an old situation and I'm over it and I'm taking a break from it. Does that make sense? Yeah, and you got the Seven of uh, Wands reverse. And the Seven of Wands reverse is someone's not wanting to fight, be defensive, or even talk about the situation. And they're not going for the bait. So I'm just thinking someone may come back from the past, like I said, with hurt feelings over a past relationship and a three-party. And another person can be coming in as a water sign, giving you a bit of a message or even an offer of something. So... That is your reading, Gemini, and uh, sorry the camera keeps on trying to go sideways, but it is what it is, and I'll put this out as soon as I can, okay? Talk to you later. Bye.